Blue. Um, hmm, not sure if you can hear me, but yeah, you probably can. Uh, we're gonna play some Pong. I did. I found an emulation thingy mill offer, and we're gonna try and play some Pong. Sorry, it's so slow. Uh, it's all right, but I wouldn't really play it a lot because serving is really awkward and is not like a written normal Pong at all. Like, the angle, the angle you got, the other player got a point on is the exact angle it starts, and you can never get to it in time because the controls are so jittery, so. Wouldn't really recommend it, but it's pretty fun thing to do sometimes. See, does that. it doesn't go up high enough. Either that or I just suck at Pong, which is kind of hard to believe. Yeah, so if, if you were wondering, this is uh, a Pong emulator called DICE. And it's a CPU-based uh, running Pong emulator. And, yeah. It's free download if you just look up their website or something, or find it on the internet for download. Uh, it's got more than one game, actually. There's Pong Doubles, which isn't really anything different. Uh, oh! There's this, which is actually kind of fun. It's basically just, you have to bounce the ball to the other player, and whoever drops it, the other player gets a point for you dropping it. This is much more functional than the Pong. There's also this. Which is basically just like cat and mouse. But we're gonna turn that off. Because. There's also. This. Uh, what you have to do, you have to dodge stars. Or whatever you wanna call them. And, um, for some reason, my controls are backwards. Yeah, if a pixel of your plane touches a uh, star, then you lose. But once you get it to the top of the screen, it comes out the bottom, and... Yeah. Um... That's dice. See ya.